Hi everyone, I'm so excited. Today we have a BPM exclusive. We have special access to Dodger Stadium for a personal tour. And we have Dodger team historian, Mark Landro. PK, very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Mark. So trolley Dodgers. And if you look at this photo, you can see a trolley right in front of Ebbets Field. And so basically, our name Dodgers means please don't get hit by the trolley. <laughs> Try to get out of the way because the fans in Brooklyn had to walk around with streetcars and trolleys in the background. So Trolley Dodgers was eventually shortened just to Dodgers. Right on. There's a lot of history right here. Here we have Jackie Robinson, and number 42 is now the most famous number in baseball. Yep. And Jackie wore this with the Dodgers. His rookie season, 1947, became the first African American to appear in the major leagues. And here is Jackie signing his first contract with the Dodgers. And he really had a historical career. He came from the Negro Leagues. And uh, this has very famous uh, Negro League players on the signed jersey. This is one of the biggest reasons why I love uh, being a Dodger fan is the fact that Jackie Robinson, you know, first African American in the major leagues, and the fact that the Dodgers are the first team to bring the first African American player. I have so much pride uh, being a Dodger fan because of that. So number 42 may be a famous number, but number two is also a famous number, belonging to the great manager Tommy Lasorda. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy. <laughs> How's it going? It's Tommy Lasorda right there, a legend. Now if you look on this side, the Dodgers took a special tour of Japan and you can see all the different photos and up top there, uh, Duke Snyder's kimono. Uh, they played 22 games. They played 22 games in Japan? 22 games in Japan. So the Dodgers played an integral role in why the Japanese league is so, so big now, right? It was a perfect match between a country that loved baseball so much and a very famous American team. Dodgers down for the Asians, you know what I'm saying? This wall PK has every Dodger, both Brooklyn and Los Angeles, and you can see whether 20 minutes or 20 years in the major leagues, uh, they're on this wall, and I think you can see a familiar name up there. I do, Chan Ho Park, and uh, I was here with my brother when uh, he got in that famous fight, you know, Tim Belcher tagged him a little too hard, and he has a Korean temper, Korean's of a bad temper. He did this Taekwondo drop kick, and it just caused this big rux. Everybody was like, you don't kick in baseball, and do you don't do those martial arts Asian kicks? And my brother and I were like putting our head down in embarrassment. It made for great TV, the first karate kick in Dodger history. <laughs> and I was there. I was here. Yeah. Well, PK, you mentioned Kurt Gibson and the home run was the most important Dodger memory to you. And right before you go on the field at the ballpark, Kurt Gibson, 1988 World Series home run, the last thing you see before you get to the field, the greatest moment in Southern California sports history. So my two older brothers, the one thing that they always did was take me to Dodger games and they spent so much time with me. That's what the Dodgers mean to me, is time with my older brothers. And we were watching from home and the Oakland A's were supposed to destroy the Dodgers. And I remember when Gibby was up there and when, when Lasorda brought him up, there was this Hollywood moment. We're like, oh gosh. And I, right, right before the home run, I remember my brother saying, how crazy would it be if he hits this out? And when he hit it out, we were jumping up and down going crazy and we were like yelling out into the whole neighborhood at Burbank and people were yelling back at us and we were hugging and crying. And that's how much this moment means to me is just the time with my brothers growing up and it's priceless. And every time I see this, that's what it means. And I just, I love this picture right here. And it just shows anything is possible. PK, it's been a pleasure to have you here. And I can tell that you love history, and I've enjoyed talking it with you. Thank you so much, Mark Langell, Dodger team historian. Hey everyone, what a magical day we had here at Dodger Stadium. It was surreal. I'm an even bigger Dodger fan. Go Blue, think Blue, go Dodgers. Let's do this. I can't wait to come back to Dodger Stadium again.